What we found out uh, in our work in Bangladesh is that the best way to try and, uh, and shift some of those gender norms and, and try to, to shift some of the dynamics between men and women is by linking that to some other intervention, uh, for example a new technology, because addressing gender norms in itself is, is not going to be very easily accepted. So for example we've started testing uh, a new type of nets that are more suitable for women to use and what we, would wa what we wanted to find out is if we could get better benefits for women in terms of uh, their empowerment and also in terms of household food security if we link that to a gender transformative approach. So in some communities we've started testing different approaches to uh, make gender norms uh, a topic of discussion and, that, and bringing in both men and women, also sometimes mothers-in-law and also at the community level with community leaders. And in other communities we just provided the other nets, uh, the new nets, uh, without doing that. So what we're measuring in the end is, is the level of empowerment uh, that has, whether that has increased or not, um, and also the level of household food security because the nets are really uh, aimed at catching a small fish species, mola, which is really nutritious.